Spider-Man Far From Home is finally out and is the true conclusion of Phase 3 of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Avengers Endgame was spectacular, but Iron Man's death was felt both in that movie and has heavily impacted Spider-Man. Far From Home delivered a Spider-Man movie that, without spoiling it, helped Spider-Man accept the world without Iron Man and start a new chapter in his life. There are tons of great new and returning characters, especially Mysterio, but the one who appears in the mid-credits scene is above the rest. Be warned, from here on out, there are major spoilers for Far From Home ahead. The mid-credits scene has Spider-Man and MJ land after swinging around when a news report gets their attention. It reveals the supposed details that Spider-Man not only killed Mysterio, but also activated the drone attacks that killed tons of people. Obviously, we know this isn't true because we watched the movie, but someone very convincing reveals one last piece of information. J.K. Simmons returns to J. Jonah Jameson, which I'm insanely excited for, and reveals to everyone that Peter Parker is Spider-Man, and the scene promptly ends. While the return of J. Jonah Jameson could have just been a cameo for comic and Raimi fans, he's actually used to kick off the next phase of the MCU. This sets up a story where Spider-Man is hated, being attacked by the city for Mysterio's death, with J.J.J. in control, maybe even sending some spider slaves after him. Obviously, that sounds incredible for the third Spider-Man movie, but it also lays the groundwork for Phase 4 and onward of the MCU. The original Iron Man ended with Tony Stark revealing his identity as Iron Man, which was a huge moment for the character. This scene is a parallel to that, except Spider-Man's identity is revealed by JJJ, not Peter Parker himself. Also, JJJ's appearance here could be felt more in future movies with the appearance of either him or the Daily Bugle dealing with other superheroes. In fact, there's one new captain that could definitely have an interesting story dealing with the media. As the MCU has gone on and grown, the movies have only gotten better, and Spider-Man Far From Home is a testament to that. It took the setup of the already great Spider-Man Homecoming and expanded on every aspect of it. Mysterio was incredible, Peter and his classmates are all great, and while on its own that puts it way up in my favorite MCU movies, the mid-credits return of Jameson's setup for the next movie really just blows all the other Spider-Man movies out of the water. Except for Spider-Verse, that is. But what do you think about how J. Jonah Jameson's return will impact Spider-Man in the future? Let me know in the comments below. Leave a like if you want more videos like this, and subscribe to make sure you get all the new videos I make. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.